It's the job of thousands of people to keep Malmstrom from Air Force Base safe, but there are a few jobs that just can't be done by humans. Our Tavares Haywood was on the base this morning and explains. Behind the gates at Malmstrom is a variety of components the Air Force Base uses to keep them safe. And today, they've added a brand new weapon to their arsenal. But despite the general nature of this weapon, it is not to be played with. Let's check it out. Okay, out. Good, mine. Meets military working dog Kay and his handler, Airman Benjamin Huntley. Kay is the newest member of the 341st Security Forces Squadron and also in his first duty job. Kay's sole purpose is to use his keen sense of smell. We'll do detection work, so that's basically the order that my dog is trained on. We're going to go out and I need to make sure that he can uh, stay proficient in finding those aids. Those aids include narcotics, but before he can actually get to work, much like his human counterpart, he has to go through basic training. So obedience is one of the biggest things because uh, I need to trust that my dog is going to basically listen to me. Stay. Stay. Kay is a Belgian Malinois and is part of a five dog kennel at Malmstrom. And their sole purpose in the Air Force is not only to protect the base, but also the handler. Okay. This is the third K-9 Airman Huntley has handled, and he says beyond the training, one of the most important skills the team must learn is to have faith in one another. Basically, you're putting your life on line with that MWD, and your MWD is going to trust you the same way you trust him. But you have to understand that you have a job to do, and uh, the next MWD is going to be your, your new job. MWD K turns two next week and will spend the rest of his career right here at Malmstrom Air Force Base. In Great Falls, I'm Tavares Haywood for Montana right now.